All right. So last time, we uh we went a little ape shit last time, and took out some horrible, horrible people in equally horrible ways. What the fuck is that thing in the mirror? It looks like there's a little face in the left of the mirror there. I'm seeing faces everywhere in this game. But uh, yeah, we just got home from another murder, so maybe we should like I don't know, take a bath or something. And let's just take a quick little whisk, because I'm sure she needs it, after that whole bleach and cannibalism adventure. I'm considerate to her needs. Yeah, this time it's probably a long, hot bath. Yeah, exactly. Oh, there she- oh, well, this just- okay, I'm- I'm banned from Twitch, clearly. Miss Ashworth. I need to ask you something. Can I come in? I'm in the bar. Is it something important? Yes, very important. The fate of the world depends on it. I'm naked here, you know. Whatever it is, it can wait. <laughs> you can come in if you promise you're not a lesbian. <laughs> you know what? I like the idea of Susan having a sense of humor. You can come in. If you promise you're not a lesbian. A lesbian? I told you I had a boyfriend, Miss A. Joke's on you, she's so bi. True. We shouldn't get embarrassed of each other. Where do you get ideas like that? I don't know. It seems everyone is gay these days. Wow, no, okay, Boomer. That's okay with me. Don't get me wrong. But I don't necessarily want a lesbian to stare at my boobs, if you know what I mean. I mean, you've met a couple of killers that would do that. Boobs. I'll take my top off and look in the mirror. <laughs> right. Come in, then. Hello. Cooking up some pancakes. Oh, like that's lovely. Ones? You got strawberry jam. You're not gonna ask strawberry how the whole kidnapping thing went? Uh, is that the reason you're interrupting my bath? Oh, nice. I like pancakes. I'll have one of each. You know what? She's doing so much for me, so let's oh. be nice. Nice. I like pancakes. I'll have one of each. Oh, no. You'll have two of each. Oh. I made so many that would be enough for an army. I don't really eat much. That's because you haven't tried my pancakes yet. Now that's an if attitude I like. Alone now, I never will. Really? Why? I can smell something funny. I what? think your pancakes are burning. Oh! <laughs> I'm so full up. Where did you learn to cook like this? This is oddly heartwarming so far. He was the king of pancakes. I'll wash up, if you like. I can do that. I like washing up. You do? Really? Really. I'm a good girl. And this is my treat for you, after all. <laughs> you did just escape a salad finger's wife and her henpecked husband, so... And you always felt like something was missing. Do you think it will ever stop? I mean, what if it doesn't? What, the ring? And it will rain for a million years. I'm not sure I get it. What's the point of that? What What's happening now? It was called again. For the third time. Social ah. network. <laughs> Why is it so difficult to remember? I just find the whole idea really stupid. Oh, she's teasing her Why Facebook. Why would I want to tell people that I'm having a shit day? So maybe you would feel better for sharing it with your friends. Are we just in like but a I good times montage friends. right now? No, you wouldn't with this attitude. You, on the other hand, seem to have 274 of them. How is that even possible? Well, what can I say? I'm very likable. <laughs> you are. Wow, that's pretty cool. So, they come every time you play the piano? Yeah, I don't really play that often. Mostly when I feel really sad. Maybe I actually play more often than I thought. You saddo. I know a song written just for you. Oh boy. Remind me to play it for you sometime. But she's definitely not emo, you guys. Before definitely not. All flowers in time bend towards the sun. <laughs> really? That's a hell of a title. Flowers. Yeah. Of course they do. Do you know it? It's written by Jeff Buckley. He would have been bigger than Cobain, you know. I never heard of him. Mm. 
probably didn't. Oh my god, you really are a hipster. That fucking cat. Hmm. How long time has passed, I wonder? Yep. I've created a profile for you. Maybe now you'll learn how to use it. What am I gonna do with it? Just look for people you know. Invite them, talk to them. It's a good way to keep in touch. Maybe you could refresh some old friendships? I don't know. I can't think of any names. I probably never really cared enough about any. I don't think that's true. How about people you went to school with? Just your old colleagues from work? Nope. Hmm. I mean, I realize this can be very, very Friends. difficult. Don't get me wrong. Zero. At least they're right about one thing. I'll add you later. That'll be a start. Exactly. I made us some coffee. <laughs> Sit down and talk to me for a moment. I'm having a bad day. You were some company. Oh, you're having a bad day. How many murderers did you escape from recently? Sure. Coffee sounds great. Or I could just go to my bedroom. <laughs> no, let's sit down and have some coffee with her. Sit. There we go. Plop What's your butt wrong, down. Mitzi? Well, I'm not sure how to get started with this thing. I've been thinking about it the last few days and I just don't seem to get any good ideas. What, on how to catch the eye of Adam? I've been a fool all along. Deluding myself that I could find where that sick bastard is hiding. Maybe I can help you. I have lots of free time, you know? Last night, I made this, well, map. A map? You mapped out the po Oh, hello! I made a map. This is our building. All four floors. Look at there you getting up and doing things. Floor. It's almost like Mitzi's presence helps. You really want to help me? That's so great, Miss A. How will I ever pay you back for this? I'll think about it later. But we haven't found him yet, have we? No. But I feel that together we stand a chance. Mm -hmm. So, let's talk about it. What do we know already? Alright. Uh, I know that rude bald guy lives in flat 6. I'm pretty sure one of the flats is empty. There's an odd married couple that lives next door. We can cross off our own flat, of course. Strange noises from floor 7. Sometimes I hear a dog bark on floor 1. There's a woman with a baby living upstairs. Well, the things we know for certain is that we can, we can cross out our own. Flats, of course. Yep, good. That leaves us with only 7 flats. Yeah. Also, there's an old man in flat 5, right opposite the Brian's place. And Brian would be the, um, the rude guy, right? I know that rude, bald guy lives in flat 6. I told you about him, didn't I? I think so. It's that guy who came complaining about the noise, right? right. Yeah, and then he that called the pest control, and we all know how that turned out. Him on the map. What else do you know about him? Not much. Wait, I remember some woman lived there with him. I've not seen her for ages. They must have split up. Could he mm -hmm. be our potential suspect? That jerk? Never. I mean, if we've learned anything so far, it's that literally anybody can be anything behind closed doors. Yeah, I suppose so. I think so. Okay, let's take a closer look at him then. I'm pretty sure one of the flats is empty. There's an old married couple that lives next door. So let's There's cross an them. an old married couple that lives next door. Yeah? What do you know about them? Well, the man is called Joe Davis. He seemed nice, quiet type, but I heard him shouting a couple of times, and he sounded almost like a different person. Huh. Like a madman, you know? Interesting. I gather they must have some serious relationship problems. Could we turn down the music a little bit? It's impossible to hide this personal dirt from your neighbors. I know it's none of my business, but I can't just plug my ears and pretend I don't hear what's going on there. You gossip. And why? Ivy Davis. Or is it Sophie? I can't remember now. 
Anyway, she's very polite, always says hello when we pass by each other in the hall. She's one of those size double zero ladies, so skinny you could easily take her for a coat lap. <laughs> a walking skeleton. I bet she you can't help but be morbid, can you? Day, or nothing at all. She looks quite ill, actually. Hmm. Anything else? They used to have a cat, Lucifer. <laughs> the cat was named Lucifer? To the poor little chap. All right, well, now we know that. There are strange noises coming from flat seven. Sometimes I hear a dog barking on floor one. There's a woman with a baby living upstairs. But that can't be right. Or unless she means the top floor, which she probably does. There's a woman with a baby living upstairs. Her husband? I'm not sure. I hardly ever see her. When I do, it's usually in the hall. When she's pushing a pram with a baby inside, she always has tons of shopping hanging from it. Mm. I nearly asked her once if she needed help to carry it upstairs. And? I hesitated for a moment, and by the time I offered, she grabbed the baby and the shopping bags and marched off upstairs. Really? Huh. All right. Oh, um, I'm being told in the chat that Joe Davis in Flat 3 is the main character of another of this person's games. So we'll definitely have to visit them if we get the chance. Um, there are strange noises coming from Flat there 7. Are strange noises coming from Flat 7. Interesting. What kind of noises? Like screaming, explosions, guns. What? Then there are threats. Insults. It's just some dude playing video games. Hmm. I think I might know what's going yeah. on there. <laughs> it's worth checking anyway. Do you know the person who lives in that flat? No, I don't. It's the top floor. I have no business going. Wow, up the there. music is way too loud compared to the speech right now. From neighbors' gossips. Yeah, that's definitely just some dude playing video games. There's no doubt. Pretty sure one of the flats is empty. I'm pretty sure one of the flats is empty. Hmm. Which one? I think it's the one on the first floor. Sometimes I hear a dog barking on floor one. First floor? Well, you said one of the flats was empty. Yes. Which means the owner of the other flat keeps a dog. All right. I well. hate dogs. Me about I love dogs. Noisy, smelly creature. Fuck both of you. I love dogs. Can you imagine the eye of Adam being a dog lover? Can't see why not. In that case, it might be worth looking into. Fuck both of you. I love dogs. I'm, I'm actually upset now. Okay, I think that's all we know. I think that's all that we know at the moment. I don't care if she's the cat lady. Dogs are awesome. Fuck her. You mentioned a pram. What? This reminds me. I found an old baby pram in my bedroom among all the stuff. Uh oh. Oh no. You have kids, Miss Ashworth. No, I see where this is going. No, I don't have children. Why do you want to know? I don't want to talk about. It. Oh crap. I don't have children, but you did, didn't you? Oh boy, this no. No. I don't have children. But I've seen too many depressing stories. I know where this is going. Come on, Miss A. It's Damn right. it! You can talk to me about it. Did you see any? Do you see any kids here? You don't want to know about my problems. I just really want us to be friends. I swear to God, I could do with one. I'm sure you are. I'm sure I'm you guys are friends. Friendships. I thought that was rather obvious. Friends should trust each other, you know. No, 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 no. Stop. Stop. We've just had Jack this wonderful knows. montage. Don't do this. Why can't you just do the same? You told me about Jack because you wanted to. I didn't force you, did I? My private stuff is nobody else's business. And up she went. Why does everyone want to remind me of this all of a sudden? Isn't ten terrible years of suffering enough to let go and never bring up, it up again? There we go. Even... Even for me?
Oh, what broke now? What? What just Especially happened? I, I'm so sorry. Your mug. It was an accident. Oh, she dropped the mug. Ah, crap. Well, you're really going out of your way to show some you distance know, between them now, just huh? Just leave it. I don't even care anymore. Ah, what the fuck now? If he's that screamy dude again, I swear I will kick him in the fucking teeth. Who is it? Hang on a second. Huh. Um... What the Powers. fuck? What's that? Who's this? What's happening? What? What's that in your other hand? Uh Go away. Leave me alone. Can someone explain? What the fuck? Okay, you're gonna want to back off. Oh boy. What exactly is happening right now? Oh, I'm controlling her. Okay. Mitzi? Mitzi, honey, wanna help out? What the actual fuck is happening? Where did this guy come from? What just... <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what just happened? I'm like genuinely confused right now. Fucking crow, out of here. I don't want to talk to you again. Is this a flashback now? Or did we get kidnapped again? Where the fuck am I? Oh. Okay. Let's maybe not get too carried away out there yet. Um. What the fuck? Okay, let's look around. What the hell am I looking at? There doesn't seem to be much I can interact with. A bunch of creepy walls with faces in them because why not all right this room why did it have to be this room oh this is some kind of dream flashback nonsense crap oh what just happened there oh it seems i'm trapped in my own living room well it's not really my apartment i hope it isn't i didn't even check those other doors out there maybe i can push it I don't think I'm strong enough to break through this wall. Shit. Oh, here comes the crazy music. Uh, what? Could you not? Well, this sucks. Strange. The back of the mirror seems loose. Could there be a secret compartment behind it? My fingers are too thick. I need something sharp to lodge it. Rag. An old torn up piece of cloth is resting on my coffee table. What's that? There's a knife underneath. Good, knives have been quite useful lately. Oh dear. Okay. Well. I guess we're using a knife. No, what? No! Wait! What? Stab what? No! I was just trying to use it! What the fuck? Hmm. Don't stab! Jesus! Use! Ah, I knew there was something hidden there. A key and... What is that? A lever? Okay. What? Let's examine the key. The key to the spare bedroom currently meets his room. But I can't go there because th there are walls and shit. I think I'm strong enough to break through this wall. But I didn't get anything to push it with. 
pull the lever. Oh! I didn't realize I had to do it that way. Whoops. A maze! Hold on, there's just a fucking maze in here? What? This is getting incredibly bizarre. Well, breaking down the walls. I have no clue what the fuck is happening right now. I'm deeply confused. Locked. Well, I do have a key, so... That's something. Maybe I should check the other rooms first. If I can use the mace. Okay. Oh, she doesn't want to go that way. Since I found a key, I might as well check out that door. Yeah, right. How convenient, story-wise. I don't like that the music is going crazy. That means something bad is gonna happen. What the fuck am I looking at? Oh! This place again! Only two ca- Wait, wait, there are three candles left, but I've killed three parasites. That's weird. I don't think I like Dead World. We must be dead again, because that guy, you know, clobbered us with whatever the fuck that was. But we killed three parasites, so why the hell are there three candles? That's weird. Well, I guess we gotta blow one out to get back. Up! Whoa, 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 whoa! Jeez! Take a fucking driving lesson! What the <laughs> I don't think that's how car crashes work. Uh, okay. Well, I guess I'm back here. It's lo- wait, what? Then what did unlocking it accomplish? I'm deeply confused. Okay, I guess we're just done with that. Uh, hello? What the fuck are you? Monster. What is this thing? I think the worst thing about it is it looks a little bit like me. Oh no, this is a crib, isn't it? Oh, I don't like where this is going. Also, my shadow moves a little faster past this one. It's a, it's a little disorienting. Alright, well, that was pleasant. Examine padlock. Ah, crap, it's a... Code. Yeah, that's... I don't have that. So, fuck this for now. Alright, well... Oh, that makes more sense. The candles are the sacrifice of soul. That's right. That's it's it's a revive. That makes a lot more sense. I thought they represented each of the parasites. I can't see anything useful there. Just old parts of boats and empty barrels. Hmm. Ship. Look at. That is a ship, all right. It's hard to tell from the distance, but it looks completely abandoned. Okay. It would probably just fall apart if I got in. It's so old and rotten. Where the flying fuck am I? Sign. Read. I can't understand most of it. It's all technical stuff. Whoops. Wait, what's this? Minimum passengers handling cap capacity. Two. How bizarre. Why is that bizarre? Well, I guess we found an elevator, so we might as well activate it and see what happens. There's no power. It must be activated somewhere else. Maybe that building at the bottom of the pier. Hmm. So, how do I get there? To the bottom of the pier. I still have the mace. That's interesting.
So what building at the bottom of the pier? Oh, 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 I see. Okay, there's a big old three there. Damn, I did not see that. Okay, so, so that must be one part of the password. Gotta look around for others. So a three. And, uh, oh, 384. 384. Oh, that is actually really clever. I didn't even consider that this was an option. Or 381, unless, no, it has to line up with the background. So it's 384. That's, well, the first one is maybe a little on the nose. I'll say that much, especially since it makes no sense physically, but that that's pretty clever, I gotta say. <laughs> 384 384 There we go Panel There's a small hole on the side of the panel I guess I need some kind of lever to operate it That makes sense That goes for all of them Apparently Okay Machinery. I've seen this machine before when I first visited this wicked world of the dead. Back then it was my blood that turned it on. But didn't I just revive myself? Oh! I also have to make a sacrifice of blood. Right. Main panel. Examine. Looks a bit different than the others. Well, something happened. There's a noise coming from above, but I can't see what's making it. Okay, so... Yeah! Look at me go! Look at me being a clever boy. Oh! Uh, I'm sorry, what? Oh my god, I gotta manually take the fucking thing. What the hell? What? Is happening here? Um. So I guess I'm trying to trap. Oh, I guess I'm trying to trap my reflection and kill them this way. Well, that sucks. How the fuck do I do that? I'm missing a lever though. Oh, I can take this one. Okay, that makes more sense. So I guess if I just... I mean, then I should be able to just smash her like this, which I really don't want, but... I guess that's what we're doing! Oh, you bitch! She just left! Yep. And now I can fuck her up. I'm imagining. Oh, hold on. Yeah. Bye, Mira Susan. This is going to suck. Oh, there we go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh god. That's horrible. <laughs> Christ almighty. Alright, that's the thing we did. I'm hearing noises, but... I can't seem to move. What is happening? Oh, there I am. I couldn't see myself. I'm going this way. Uh, I'm just back here now. Did that activate the elevator? I'm guessing it did. No. Oh, wait. Uh... The power is on, but it's still not working. There must be something else I'm missing. 
Doesn't look very safe, but it might be the only way out of here. Okay, so I'm still missing one more thing. What though? What about in here? Oh boy, the monster is still here. Hold on. That did not work. Whatever this thing is, I can't stab it. It looks like. I'm trying my hardest, but it doesn't work. What? How the fuck do I do it right? Oh, my reflection. My shadow has to stab it. Yeah, there we go. This is weird. That did not sound good. Oh! What the fu- So is- that's just me in- in a nurse's uniform. Or- no, that's- that's the patient's- What the hell? Why is she wearing that? Oh, here comes the music. And so I face my final curtain. <laughs> Come on, honey. We're going this way. Come on in. Join me in the elevator, why won't you? Just don't fart, it'll be awkward. Alright then. Now we can go. Goodbye, other world. That was really weird. I don't think it's gonna stop being weird yet. I can't do anything in here. Oh, but up. Uh, more bodies. Is this like... Well, oh no, what's happening? What's fucking up the elevator? What? Oh! Oh, this sucks. What's happening? What?